in with Madison. Hey there! Are you ready to hear a story? <laughs> Asian Adventures: Delicious Asian Foods from A to Z by Yobi Chu and illustrated by Cynthia Lee. A is for Asia, the continent of delicious foods. B is for bibimbap, rice mixed with yummy toppings served in hot stone bowls from Korea. C is for chili crab, a flavorful entree from Singapore. D is for durian, a fruit so smelly but eaten by many, native to Southeast Asia. E is for edamame, a healthy soybean snack, still in the bean pod. F is for faluda, a colorful Indian cold dessert made with noodles. G is for ginger, a spicy root used in food and tea. H is for hot pot, joined by friends and families cooking and eating together. I is for instant noodles, a Japanese creation beloved worldwide. J is for jackfruit, the world's largest edible fruit found in tropical South Asia. K is for kumquat, a tasty bite-sized citrus with edible peel. L is for lak lak, also known as Cambodian shaking beef as they dance in the walk. M is for mooncake, a special treat symbolizing a reunion during the moon festival. N is for natto, a traditional Japanese food made from fermented soybeans. O is for oyster sauce, a staple of Asian home cooking. P is for pho, a warm noodle soup. Vietnam's national dish. Q is for queso ice cream, made in the Philippines with cheese. R is for roti, a round flatbread native to India. S is for sushi, made by hand with love from Japan. T is for Thai iced tea, a bright orange beverage made with condensed milk. U is for ube, a sweet purple yam from the Philippines. V is for vada, a gummy fried snack from India. W is for wasabi, a bright green paste served with sushi and oh so spicy. X is for shaolong bao, a Chinese pork dumpling with hot soup inside. Y is for yakitori, a Japanese street food of skewered chicken. Z is for zongzi a traditional Chinese sticky rice dish eaten during Dragon Boat Festival celebrations. The end. Okay, thumbs up if you enjoyed the book. Nice. If you would like to purchase this book for your at-home library, you can click on the link in the description box below to support the talented authors, illustrators, and publishers. Thank you for watching, and remember to hit the subscribe button if you want to hear more read-alouds, do some science experiments, watch videos about letters and numbers, and do some really fun arts and crafts projects with me. I'll see you next time. Bye! Thanks for watching!